Good morning, everyone. <laughs> okay, uh, let's continue our studies together. Um, yes, this is uh, the sequence about uh, alchemy, alchemy, and uh, I will continue to talk about Ouroboros. Um, you know the dragon, the dragon who who do the circle, uh, and uh, each himself or herself the dragon, okay, female or male, uh, the dragon, okay. Uh, uh, this is an archetype. Archetype, uh, it was used in many cultures to talk about the animal inside us, animal with uh, great power and um, this this famous power with to control and to produce the fire. Uh, the dragon can uh, open his mouth or her mouth and uh, spell spells uh, the fire so it's a strong animal and uh, it's used in many cultures huh? Europe uh, China uh, in many cultures uh, Japan you see this uh, figure this um, image this archetype of the dragon so you have a lot of films about it do document uh, books uh, uh, legends about the dragons so uh, let's talk about our own dragons um, in our culture here western countries well uh, famous dragons money, sex, drugs, and rock and roll. <laughs> well, first one, money. Uh, person say, said, uh, you can sell your soul with the right price. So, this is the dragon, the money. Who, can, uh, who that can buy everything without limits. This is a force you need to control, the money. Because what you will, will do for money? We will kill someone, we will put someone in danger, um, hunger, you, you, you will produce wars because money. So think about it. This is the first dragon, the money. You need to control this force uh, to produce a, a new type of energy, the money. The second dragon, um, sex. Okay. Um, uh, here, in Western countries, the most of persons are Christians, and yes, uh, uh, Jesus uh, was a, a great influence uh, in our culture, and people uh, learned a lot to control um, their bodies because it, it Christianism. But uh, of course, it's it's not. Uh, uh, the entire uh, situation for all persons. Uh, there are many cultures, uh, different cultures, uh, and how to uh, uh, dominate, uh, control your body about sex. Well, uh, we have uh, another situation uh, when uh, total liberation after 60s or great liberation um, for for ta for scales uh, and uh, people become more more conscious about their bodies uh, 
women and men, and not so much con religious control. Uh, Michel Foucault uh, wrote about it, this liberty, this uh, uh, freedom to use your body when you like, where the way you like. Uh, but uh, we perceive the, in our Western countries, uh, the dragon, the sex dragon, is about uh, the violence. So uh, we have two uh, main situations. Um, you know, the violence, uh, we have cases uh, to uh, pornography uh, and sell, uh, uh, sell this pornography for money. Uh, uh, and the persons uh, who are slaves, sexual slaves, um, we have a lot of cases of sexual harassment. Uh, the movement uh, Me Too proved it, time's up, uh, many movements is, few years ago, uh, two or three years, uh, a lot of cases, in, including uh, famous persons, um, uh, stars, um, Hollywood stars, uh, Bollywood stars, many, many uh, important men and women, uh, persons who are, uh, who are very beautiful and rich uh, involved in this kind of uh, situation when the sex was used to hurt other people and uh, uh, so much of violence and uh, we have uh, cases here in Europe uh, you can buy persons buy uh, bodies um, uh, women and men sell themselves for money, uh, for sex. Well, uh, this is the situation. This is a dragon, okay? Uh, a force, a very a strong force uh, who can arm you or arm others. And uh, the other, um, the other situation, uh, we have the third dragon, uh, drugs. Well, we talked a little bit about it yesterday, but uh, yes, um, uh, the drugs in, in many communities, uh, uh, it's we have this information the use of drugs uh, to obtain pleasure, um, but uh, many uh, ways to these drugs uh, are are sold to uh, by criminals, uh, criminals, persons who use these drugs to obtain money and sell drugs to other persons. Uh, and uh, these drugs can destroy the bodies. Um, the drugs can destroy the bodies, and of course, uh, many lives, family lives, entire societies. We have many cases, of, like last century, the opium, uh, this century, cocaine, uh, the other drugs, we have a lot of drugs this century. Uh, alcohol too. Well, there are other types. Tobacco, it's considered nowadays a type of drug too. So the body, uh, this is a strong force. Uh, when you use the drugs to uh, generate pleasure, uh, but just produce same time your destruction or destruction other persons and the fourth the fourth uh, dragon rock and roll um, <laughs> well rock and roll it's about the music 
It's about uh, the pleasure you can feel uh, when uh, you listen to the song, uh, and when you dance, uh, when you are just rich. Uh, but at the same time, uh, this kind of, uh, of music sometimes is like a drug. And those, uh, so, um, those shimmels uh, are like uh, an a hypnosis and uh, so many persons become dependent of uh, this situation um, to uh, to be happy so it's like um, uh, a situation when uh, you are not using your body to favor you but against you so we are talking about money, sex, drugs, and rock and roll. We are talking about the body, you know, like about what you release, what you release, and uh, we can smell uh, our tastes, our vision, uh, what we can feel. Uh, this is our bodies. So, uh, same time, our bodies, it's absolutely uh, when we, when what we are, okay, we, our presence is, is inside our bodies. Um, the same time, is, uh, this, uh, you need to control your body because this strong force inside uh, ourselves uh, we are same way we are similar we are similar to dragons too we can produce fire with our bodies so it's very interesting uh, um, for example uh, I can uh, kiss someone and a day after um, a person uh, can know about this situation, my personal situation, in another country. <laughs> it is strange, uh, but it's happened because of the internet, the communications, and uh, like this dragon um, is very dangerous because why are you observing the other person? Um, it's a kind of voyeurism, do you know? A kind of voyeurism. It can become um, a mental disorder, a sexual disorder or uh, a disorder for money. So people uh, sell magazines, newspapers with the other lives and uh, can destroy this person with uh, the comments. So nowadays we are observing important persons who uh, uh, don't care uh, to be on newspapers or magazines because of this privacy invasion. Uh, so, you cannot uh, tell someone is a prostitute uh, uh, because the person kissed other person or had, have, had sex with other person. It is, it is a misunderstood of the reality. If the persons who are involved in this kind of material, all these persons are criminals who sell these informations. They are criminals. This is privacy invasion. So, uh, well, we are talking our bodies, about our bodies, and uh, this is the drug on all days, okay? We will continue in the next video. This is the dragon. Um, nowadays, I can see clearly. Uh, 
Money. Sex. Drugs and rock and roll. Let's continue. <laughs> 